books are written on this. On this. Dude, I read the Bible, and I'm not a religious fucking yeah. person. Dude, in Revelation 18, it describes this exact time, and it shows it's a conspiracy between the Catholic Church, the Antichrist, the fucking Masons that were started by the Catholic Church, and they run all the governments, businesses, media, and everything in the world. And they realize that we're getting fucking smart. So they're like, oh shit, we better fucking control them. Six feet apart, 666. In Europe, it's half of that, three feet apart. And then making us wear these fucking masks. Yeah. And dude, interrupt me if you want. No, 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 this is right on, on, on point with, yeah, yeah. with my channel. And I was like fucking kicking back in an IHOP parking lot. Okay. And my spirit guide goes, hey, what do you think if you split right now? And I'm like, okay, that's cool. So I went on State Street and I'm like, where are we going? And he goes, just wait. So I came over here and he goes, what do you think about making a left? Because he always makes suggestions, allowing right. me the option. Awesome. And yeah. buff, I parked here yeah. and I saw you walking. And all of a sudden he goes, that dude right there, he's a deep thinker. Oh, that's where man. fucking shit crossed. That's, that's amazing because that's where, this is where it happens, man, over by the, the lemon. This lemon tree inn ha yeah. has that vibe. Like it's a blue it's, zone, huh? Exactly. Fuck, dude. That's the color, yes. Shit. Wow, What's right your on. Name? Misha, what's your name? And my name is John Paul Schaefer. John Paul Schaefer, Misha yeah. Bonar. Nice oh, to meet cool. you. Where are you from, anyway? I'm from here, Santa Barbara, California. Where are you from? Oh, I was born in Glendale and okay. raised in Tahanga. All right. And I moved to Montana. Whoa. And that's where my car's from. It's a Montana car. Whoa. I'm a gearhead. You, you drove it over here? Yeah, because you know why, dude? Why? I had a really fucked up childhood, uh. and I'm a perfectionist. Uh, okay, so yeah, I'm a fucking a electrical contractor, Yeah. and I had to come back to face my shit. So it's here? In California. So with I, electrical in construction? Yeah, and I ah. and, and all the shit that I ran from as a child. Yeah. You know, I I had the shit beat out of me when I was a kid. Bullied, punched and kicked. Yeah. And mm -hmm. I asked for height and wisdom. So people would have So you got me. it. Yeah, you got yeah. the height for yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. And And wisdom. Yeah. The good 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 mix. Yeah, yeah. You know, right because on. fuck Dude, I always ask questions. Yeah. Why the hell this? Why the hell? I hope I'm not burning you out with too much info. No, I love this stuff. Like yeah. I said, uh, not many people here like to talk about it. I, I do this channel on um, YouTube. Yeah. And I'm meeting people in Europe. Yeah. And there's one, they're all into like conspiracy theories, but ones that have logic to them. Yeah. Or that have a happy in it. Ending exactly. This one does. not not like these ones where you can poke holes in them. But not only that, it's like wow, that's not even romantic. It's even not. It's not positive. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so my channel is all about just taking the positive thing. Be just be human. Like we're not labeling anyone, but don't be an asshole. That yeah, that's yeah. the only rule. And so it's open to thinking. Like what you sure, what did sure. you say? It deep thinking. I thought that was yes, like cool because. You know what? what? I'm almost 59 years old. Wow. Okay. Excellent. I want to turn, like, I, I want to be able to look that way. Yeah. And, 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 and be able to say, and, and you're coming back to, to, yeah. some, to see some demons that you're vegan. afraid of? Yeah, And yeah. you're a vegan now? Yeah. Whoa. I've been a vegan How for long? 38 fucking years. 38 years? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Whoa. Okay. Well, yeah. I have newfound respect because I usually joke sometimes. My sister's vegan and... Well, you, know, you know, and sometimes I make these jokes because I enjoy the IHOP menu, like yeah. for breakfast. Mm -hmm. So you know what it is? It's like bacon, yeah. uh, net, um, butter on the pancakes, net. There's probably whatever else is in the pancakes, eggs, uh, cream in the coffee. Sure. It's just this thing whenever I'm having breakfast with my sister where I'm like, oh, this, I want to be Kerouac on the road having this breakfast, yeah. <laughs> She's like looking at me, you know, like, how many slices? Could you at least get two slices of bacon and not four? Sure. And so I'm sitting there like eating, like trying to listen to her, but I'm feeling guilty I don't of the, the animal, jokes. you know what I mean? But I've always thought of it more like, I thought it was disrespectful 
to once they're dead, like to eat them or not eat them. Do you know what I mean? Oh yeah, like yeah, an yeah. Indian sure. going. I've just decided to let the buffalo rot there sure. instead of using every oh, use bit all their of shit. No, you dude, know what I'm I mean? Cool Where they're that. going, they were respecting the animal. Yeah. I totally get the factories and the cruelty and all that. Whoa, I don't want to even be eating that stuff. But to the point of being like, let's go, you know, get somebody who's wearing a warm full. You know what I mean? Like if there's yeah, a homeless yeah. guy wearing a warm f- sure. a fur or. Maybe it's rabbit fur. It's yeah, super yeah, comfy. Yeah. Like he got sure. it vintage that some lady's going to go with red paint or... Sure. Do you know what I mean? And just make that yeah, the deal. Sure, oh, let's sure. get the homeless out of here because they're not vegans and they don't respect our animals. Yeah. When they get that way, when they'll see someone on the street and go, we should really take their pet from them. We know. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, yeah. Where you know that there's some people that are just like, I had to give up the dog because I couldn't feed him or you know what I mean I'm in a situation where what I can't have right now? I am going to um, bring my mom a mask speaking of the because uh, I, I was going to say if you wanted to chill for a while I'd like to sit and chat and listen to your ass and I oh man give you, that's I cool wanna, I want to give you a bunch of information I got papers and everything yeah. that I've compiled on this shit seriously like hand things I that are on yeah, yeah, yeah. okay well dude look can I uh, let me bring her she's not too far she's like around Galita I'm going to drive there quickly give her her mask and her stuff and then come back there's a laundromat here the guy's cool his name is Steve Law and you want to hang out and when we could sit there and hang out. I think they got chairs and yeah, I don't fuck, know. dude. All right, Jean Pierre, John John Paul Schaefer. Jean Paul Schaefer. Do you like he like uh, Led Zeppelin? Yeah, dude. I'm into all that shit. Because that's like John Paul Jones <laughs> and then yes. Paul Schaefer from yeah. New York, yeah. right, dude? Yeah, dude, dude I'm do you do you like music? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We what can what kind of what kind of music you like? Um, I I grew up. I graduated from high school in 1981. So okay. All in way, Montana? No, no, California. Oh, in Glendale. So I, I, oh. I went to Glendale. I was in Glendale, yeah. and I was raised in Tahunga. Oh, and yeah. then in 97, I moved to Northern California. In 2009, I moved to Montana. Right. And I was married for like 13 and a half years. Oh. And one day, my old lady, I found out she was fucking another dude. Oh, man, I went through that. I heard that one. Yeah. yeah. Wow, you're telling my life story. Yeah. All right. She, and talk. coming back for your demons? That's yeah, amazing. Yeah. That's yeah. amazing. Yeah, and so all the shit... I, and, and, and Is I that just, a Monte Carlo? Sorry, it's, a it's a Malibu. It's a Malibu. It's got wow, a five-speed stick in it. I do. I'm a, ma- I'm a gearhead also, so I rebuild old shit and all that. Is that like 79 or something? It, it was made in October, the third week of October, 1979. It's a 1980 Malibu, but it was made in 79 Seven. in the Tesla factory. That's no Tesla. way. You know, Tesla yeah, bought it from GM. Oh, wow. Yeah, so, yeah, dude, I'm like fucking... That's amazing. And, and this car, this license plate was issued. Yeah. 8G was issued in 2018 or early 2019. Yeah, 2018. Yeah, dude, you I, know I you're... I all that shit. Because I have like... You an, got the, the numbers thing. Yeah, because... You I'm got like, the numbers dude, thing. Dude, each one of us has a fucking genius. Yeah, and, we just haven't tapped and, and in when yet. You, t- you have one, I have one. Yeah. The next dude has yeah. one. Everybody is like puzzle pieces. And when we can fucking connect, shit is good vibes. That, that's what I've learned. You, you I have it. psychology. Yeah. That's, well, I can, I can sense it. Yeah. And now you're looking like Lemmy. <laughs> you know Lemmy from Motorhead? Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. yeah. yeah. Oh, he's come back from the dead. Thank yeah. you for yeah. that. Hey, for sure. All right, Lemmy. So, okay, and, so... And I fucking even got a tail, dude. And you got the tail, so... You, and, but you're hiding it. You know, it's Santa Barbara. You got to kind of... All right, so, like, you're just going to chill, and yeah, then... I'll I'm, chill here until you come back. All right, cool. Dude, I'd love John to John Paul Schaefer. Yeah. What Met are him you? Here. Are you, like, um, 50 or 48? Yeah, yeah, 54. Sweet, we're on the same. We're right, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah no, yeah. but but I like to see that you're four four years ahead of me, and and yeah. you're still you're and, in and, a good and, spot. And all my shit is, is still that shit works is still working. Just like it is when I was a teenager. So you're if you in don't mind talking about shit like that, I talk about everything, man. That's my channel. Sweet, okay, I'll wait for you. <laughs> all right, dude, cool, John Paul Schaefer. I met. This is it. I'll, this is... I'll wait for you here. All right, in front of the lemon tree inn. Wow. 
You weren't expecting that, were you, Italy? But yes. Strangers in the night. Wait. Uh, exchanging glances. Strangers in the night. Yeah. Oh, the secret life is uh, getting a little out of hand, is it? What is this game that's going on here? What? But I have it in the reverse. And Charlotte is no longer on the line, but it says something like, I don't even want to know who that is. It's not John Paul Schaefer. How did we get that? How did we think that, that man up? He looked like Lenny. So that's the motherhead connection. And then, uh, uh, he knew the license plate, just like that prophet did, the other one, so they know my license plate. <laughs> uh, that should be one for the First Amendment auditors. You know, Everyone's like, oh, do you see the people like, I do hear it now, they go, oh, you can't be photographing my license plate, right? Don't be publishing something. When, dude, I got characters in my book here, and my game of this city that, whoa, check it out, you gotta be joking. Here's the trade of just. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Filthy trailer show. Completely sodium. Up the kazoo. I'm very jealous. Because of my high blood pressure, I can't have... Oh, okay, it's no longer 59. Those playing the game from... From before. Now it's... Uh, 50 miles. So it's only me. What are we going to do? What are we going to do, game players? Quickly. Am I going to be a good son and bring my mom on the, the mask? Or am I going to uh, just uh, go get cheesy some food or are we going to uh, see about this character that we met yeah that we invented so we need to make a deeper background check of this character is it going to be like a lift, uh, working for lift, right? Let's do a triple check on this driver. The one who's been calling us so much. I don't like that. Why is he calling us? Why is he recording all this? Why is he recording, taking our digits and playing them back to us? Why is he doing this? You can't. He cannot. There must be some sort of law. Well, it turns out we have a lot of things that we can do. What's that you say you want to, uh, you want to use the, uh, the facilities here. Which ones? I'm not going into the bathroom in this show. I don't care how many of these coupons they're paying me off for the coffee. It doesn't, it's not good. They, Giselle spits in it now that I've gotten my way, that I put her video of her telling me, no, you cannot photography in public is not done. You cannot do it. I'm calling the police. Yeah. Ever since that one went viral, 
to. You know, her family doesn't treat me quite as nice. Her brothers, when they come to get products from me, dime bags. Dime bag. Do you see what's happening here in the book, in the story? The guy looks like Lenny. He knows my license plate number. He's telling me everything I want to hear. Everything Sylvie K. Cobain murder theory exposed. Hashtag. Yeah, that's a hashtag. That means uh, there's probably 1K. This channel, Cobain Murder Theory Exposed on the YouTube channel, it, it probably has gained a golden pillow, I am sure. If not a couple. Golden Pillow Awards, because there were some award-winning products that have come out of that channel, and just the sheer genius of the mind that produces that quality channel, YouTube, that hashtag. Cobain, murder, theory, exposed, like the nostril in my nose right now. Look, I will cut them for you. I will do that for you, silly who's sleeping. What, you'd want me to, you want to, sh you want me to shove that up my nose so that this will go viral? And all over the world, they'll see this. My daughter wakes up to this. In France, is waking up for her petit déjeuner. Yeah, just her baguette. Please, with some butter, because I want to be like my daddy. Not my mama who did. I want to be like my daddy who appreciates a good Kerouac breakfast. It's upsetting. France wants more skin. Oh. It's upsetting. I'm in a car now. I got this character who's saying that he's 58, but everything down there still works. And he hopes. He hopes I don't mind. Mm. Coming back and talking about it with him. But he's had some issues with. But he's had issues with. That sounds like it's coming from Dave the. Dave the homeless guy visiting his, his mom. But it sounds like somebody's somebody's yelling from inside it. I can't. I can't be here for that. I don't do that anymore. 
<laughs> She's been guilty with Garzo. Did you, did you hear? Have you heard that about you? She's been telling people here that she's getting a card code for three days now. And then she keeps scoring. Really good product. I can't have any. I don't do that anymore. But I can listen. I can listen to how much she's going to get and maybe what price. Like what where is she going to get it from? Hold on, I want... I need... What is my flashlight? I need the light. I need the torch. No, I need... I found it. Right. Sylvie K, when you wake up and see this, I believe that Mr. Grant Shit. Mr. Grant now is doing a transaction of I guess we know what was in the door of the Mustang. That's what was behind door number, what did we say, five or three? Mustang, we have two doors. Why, why did we think these numbers? It sounds like she's taking it out of her, not money ways oh my god I can't listen to this I have heard oh, now you're not going to let me turn up the light so I have to suffer I have heard so much stop just too much auditorially disturbing more than actually seeing because I don't I don't hear it quite, I hear too much, and then it, it, I can never get it out of my head. It's like a bad song by somebody, something, music, please turn off light. I'm going to just say please, one more time. Thank you. I'm going to, I'm going to turn the light back on. To apologize to this. I'm sorry. Sorry. I'm sorry. All right. We're getting out of here. We're trying to think of other things. Dreamcatcher, please. Please. Please, just turn off. All right. Well, Sylvie, when you wake up, you will know now that my suspicions of that old fart were not any more. Worse than my feelings for, oh, give me a family member, my, uh, Nephew. So, the uh, 2K, Mr. Red, Mr. Red Fox, his fox, Mr. Hashtag American Sign Language. Hold on. I gotta stop because the policeman over there, right, is being like, why do you have your life on like that? And in Santa Barbara, they no longer allow you to say, well, 
I'm filming something for a movie. They go, ah, you owe five hundred dollars for permit. You haven't paid that, so now it's going to be a thousand. You can't afford that. Well, we're going to take something from you. Okay, I tell you what I'm going to do. I'm putting the light on now that I'm in the suburbia, and they don't come into suburbia. They don't have the guy. And suburbia, like in Los Angeles, it's always just one step, one street over from a, um, a DUI checkpoint. Mm -hmm. And there's always a homeless person who's learned the places in suburbia, like you see, where we can hang out in people's backyards and things. And we found through the tunnel how to get under their homes and skateboard, right? That's how the skateboarders got involved in this story. That's why they started throwing things at my car. That's why I should have gone through the, uh, I should have gone through the, the, the car wash. Because now tomorrow when we make the shot for the documentary, because we needed to be quiet for the sound, because of YouTube, it's baking. Yeah. If I leave the light on, even to be a punk, it's, I can smell it. It's frying. That's how this car is. You can't let anything work for longer than I don't know how long that was. All right, I'll try to give you some fun, some front. We are living in suburbia now. Footage. It says it's going to stop the car unless we change the windshield wiper fluid. Ah. Let's not do it, people. It's a little late for that, don't you think? Do you want, do you want me to do that, Phil BK? No, you don't. Yeah, see? too late for that. Let's go towards the future, which is red right now. That's our future. Our future wants to stop right here, right now, at Highway 92 and Foothill Road. 